Yeah, it's like has I'll put your new makeup on the, um, the camera for our Facebook Live people. Maybe we should give a Fuck Facebook that off. Live. Well, we've gone from a, just a clean up for the old Clevo after doing that timing to um, an engine removal. <laughs> so, yeah. After getting in there and looking, it was a little bit ordinary. So we're going to give her a birthday. And then Baron's off the mains were shot. It's worse. It gets worse. They don't look too bad, but... Yeah. So, we just cleaned up our pistons a little bit. Then we'll send everything away. Get a bit of a hone and polish up on the crank. Pistons will be okay. I'll go again. So, next week we'll send her. And um, got a cam coming. Clean the heads up a bit. Give them a bit of a valve lap. Just polished, I didn't get any grinding or anything, just polished. Clean out some of these intake and exhaust ports. Probably can't see real good with this light. Uh, a little bit better. But yeah, just got rid of some of them casting marks. Didn't get in there and go aggressive on it. But should help. New timing chain. You can we'll put some new lifters in. They're pretty good, but you can just get a little dome in a little bit warm, but we'll put some new ones in with this new cam and break her in. Then we'll see how she runs. <laughs> Excited. Oh, then the cam, mate. Right, and one thing, my brother's got his F-150 long wheelbase pulled apart. He had this manifold there. It's been ground down. If you look stock standard, but it's alloy. And researching and a bit of a contact with the Clevo King on YouTube, jump on in if you want to look at Cleveland's, any hot tips and tricks, he's the man, the Clevo King. And he confirmed that she is an Edelbrock Performer Manifold. So, that is pretty sweet. How good's that? That's going straight on. Awesome. Alright, there's a 2V heads open chamber. Now that we're deeply evolved, <clears throat> we're just doing a bit of valve lapping. That's what I've done. You can see we're on those lands there, nice and smooth. Oh, you can see it on these here, but they're not too bad, but we just give them a touch up. These are the valves, you look at that, zoom in. You can see on those lands there and those valves, Nice clean compared to old. I will keep doing some valve lapping here. I didn't go over it. I just polished up inside there a little bit. Get some of the casting marks out. Intake side. Beautiful. box been sent, so we're just tidying up a few things with paint. We might as well get a looking good too. 
the uh, manifold, the drone, the other block performer. It was painted green. So, we painted it a Ford blue. Just masked up a bit of stuff, keeping it all stock standard, tappet covers and everything. So, we'll keep painting. We've been going through the rockers and everything. Look at the state of that. Let me get you a better picture of it. A bit of surface rust. <laughs> so we're getting them on the wheel to clean them up because I really wasn't ready for half of this. And uh, so we're cleaning them up. Since we are putting a new cam in it, got a crane cam, blue racer, new lifters. I'll see going through my new lifters here. And some of them were stuck, so I took a bit of lube on them just to make sure they weren't stuck. Something to do as a bit of a pre check, make sure they do move. And then I was going through my push rods. Look at the state of them, so it's been sitting, but while I was inspecting them, look at the ends of some of these, I'll see if I can get a picture for you, look at that, wow, she's a, uh... yeah, look at that, That ain't not too bad, but they're worn out. So, what do these need look like? Hey, look at that. They're worn thin, they're not going in, that's for sure. You lift us. And we've been painting, just getting stuff ready because I'm impatient. Bolts, pulleys. <laughs> a bit dark. Manifold's done. Just painting a few things, getting them ready. So, uh, the block, crank, pistons, everything's over at Oztec Engines in Inverell. So, yeah, we're just cleaning up some stuff here. Getting ready for when she gets back. I've seen some dodgy fucking wiring, but this takes the cake. So, they've taken it out of the bag of plug. Jumped it. And then just folded it into there. And then... Oh, exact same on the other end. <laughs> 